The new growth plan has the potential, if implemented, to double the size of the Western Balkan economy still in this decade. It has four pillars. The first pillar of the plan is bringing the Western Balkans into the single market. We basically open the door of the single market in seven key areas for the Western Balkan companies already now. Just to give you a few examples on customs cooperation, e-commerce, cashless payments, road transport, electricity, roaming, just to name a few. Now the second pillar is that the Western Balkan themselves have to complete their common regional market. If they complete their region, common regional market, this could increase the GDP of the Western Balkans by 10%. So the Western Balkans also need to open to their own neighbors, to the five neighbors and par partners, their own markets. The third pillar is reforms. If we want to give access uh, to the Western Balkans, to the European single markets, of course there needs to be a level playing field, the same rules and standards. This means reforms are necessary. And these reforms also bring, bring the Western Balkans closer to membership. These reforms will also make the Western Balkans even more attractive for European investors and make our respective economies, which is very important, converge. Because today we have a situation where the Western Balkan economies are at 35% of the EU average. So there needs to be lots of work to be done to have more convergence of the economies. And finally, the fourth pillar of the plan is if reform efforts are being done, they will be matched by increased EU funding for investment. In other words, we have proposed a 6 billion investment package. This is composed of 2 billion in grants and 4 billion in loans. And this same logic applies like in our investment plan Next Generation EU for the member states. That is investment and reforms. Funds will be relieved upon delivery of reforms. So it is conditional. It works very well in the European Union. I'm deeply convinced it will work in the Western Balkans too. 